region. Bro Clinton This Morning, a program in partnership with KROS. Catch up with Bro Clinton every Monday. We've got a very busy person in studio with us, Ashley, the yes. marketing and event planner. And you got a lot of events coming up, Ashley. A lot, yeah. Two of my biggest events are this summer. So Before we get into that, you, yep. of course, were at Tailgate and Tall Boys. You said I was. all three nights. All three nights. How'd yep. it go? Um, it was good. Um, I would definitely say attendance uh, comparatively to last year was was much higher. Um, yeah, it was it was fun. Um, Thursday was a late night. Um, Jelly Roll was performing in Detroit and, you know, had to hop on a quick plane to get down here and escorted from the airport to get to the the riverfront as soon as possible so it was windy Thursday. It, and it was win, windy too and um you know but it, it made the flags look cool that were flying <laughs> and all the food vendors and the american flag that was you know hoisted up um at the gate that was really cool um How'd yeah friday it was a go? great great community event How'd friday go? uh friday was good um bailey zimmerman was the the headliner uh big country night so um yeah it was a lot of fun that night too and then i was most excited and pumped for shine down on saturday and they just i think i would think outdid everyone's expectations if they had any expectations going into it um that's the third time i've seen shine down and um it was awesome well that is it great was to awesome. hear so yeah. of course this is year two of the three years of yep. tailgate and tall boys and we're going to have Mayor Scott Madison in on Thursday, and Josh Hagers are the kind of driving force yep. for this event. So it looks like things are moving in the right direction. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm. We're very curious um, as at the Girl Clinton office, obviously, to see um, attendance numbers. And um, there's also different data out there that tells us um, how many people came from different states. And we'll get, you know, breakdown of all that kind of information, too. Um, and then, you know, we'll assign, you know, some sort of economic impact number to the three-day event too which is really cool to see it's it's really great for our region um so yeah indeed i would awesome. imagine the people at grow clinton are very excited about something like this yes yep yep and the nerdy sides of us come out you know when we get to see all those stats after the fact the so <laughs> say annual meeting coming up yes yes um so the annual meeting is coming up a week from tomorrow uh so with that said rsvps are due thursday um, now, this is a free event for our members. Um, you know, it's a time to come and celebrate with us um, all of our successes that we're able to achieve because of our membership. Um, so it's it's just a fun night um, at the ballpark. We'll be at Lumber King Stadium. Um, the, the full event um, is advertised from 4 to 7.30 p.m. Um, and then we've got a, a short program that will start at 4.45. So right at 4 o'clock, we're going to be working on getting people registered, um, you know, come and, you know, start mingling, having a drink, hanging out, um, meeting people, you know, maybe that you don't know from different companies in the area. Uh, and then, like I said, we have a short program that will start at 4.45 where we do um, our awards and announcements. And then we'll have food and live music from Spoiler Alert. Um, now that is the band name. I'm not keeping. Guess, I'm not a keeping. Spoiler alert. <laughs> I'm not keeping the band name a secret. The name of the band is Spoiler Alert. Um, and yeah, they will play till probably 7:30, 8 o'clock. I would imagine so. everything kind of down the left field line in that area is where everything's yes. going to take place. Okay. Yep. Yep. In fact, we're going to meet with Nate today or tomorrow at uh, Lumber King Stadium just to kind of go over the setup and. Um, get good. all the food in line. But like I said, um, RSVPs for that are due on Thursday, so just so I have account for food. Get taken care everyone. of that. So yes. again, yes. golf, your other big event. Yes, my other big event is coming up uh, the last Friday in July. So uh, Friday, July 26th at Valley Oaks. Um, really excited for that event and to be planning it for the second time um, in my tenure at Grow Clinton. Uh, and um, I've, I've got sponsorships available yet for that event. Um, and then what everyone is waiting to find out is that registration opens on Wednesday. So this Wednesday, June 12th, um, it's first come, first serve, online registration. Get your foursome in. Um, we are asking uh, members that as a courtesy, if you're planning to register one team, that you, give a, you wait a couple weeks if you're planning to register a second one. Um, just one of my big goals is to, to let as many members in as possible. It just and it's and I think it's good for all businesses to I mean that that's kind of forcing you to meet new people and you know maybe you'll have new members that want to join your bank because of it or you know open an account or do business at 
at your small business, you know, whatever it may be. But the whole goal is to get as many people involved as possible um, to maximize everyone's time there. So Okay, so for them to register, it opens Wednesday? It opens Wednesday. How do they do that? Uh, they will go to our website, uh, click on the event calendar, and then go to July 26th. That'll take you to the golf day. Um, once you get to that calendar day and then the registration bu button will be active and you can register your foursome and pay online. All right. Very good. Again, visiting with Ashley on today's Grow Clinton. Uh, a biz after five, kind of a different feel to it here in June, right? Yeah. So we're going to try a little something different uh, for June and July because um, there's so many other fun things going around in town. Um, so we're going to buddy up uh, on June 24th with uh, the Great Revivalist Brewery. Um, they are uh, going to do a sip and shop vendor market. Um, it is a Monday evening. It'll be from 5 to 8 p.m. Um, is the total length of their event. Um, so we're going to help them advertise that and hopefully get as many people to to come as we can. So again, and that's check Monday, that out. June They've 24th? got okay. Monday, June 24th. Yes, that is our any our cost biz to event. get into it or no? Nope, not to my knowledge. Okay, nope. all right, very good. Nope. So what just about July come and then? come and shop around and see if there's something you can't live without. All right, shop around from local merchants. So what about July? Um, so July, uh, I'm picking the date yet, but okay. we are um, going to kind of congregate down at Music on the Avenue on one of the Thursdays in July. Okay. Um, I've never been to it, uh, and I just think it'd be a great opportunity to, to bring people down to Fifth Avenue South and listen to the live music happening there. All right. I think the first one is uh, this Thursday. I coming, believe it is, too. Coming up with uh, Brooke Byam, and uh, also coming in will be Mike Cook. Okay. We're going to visit with, he's on the Union Jacks. He's in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in Iowa. Oh, wow. Yeah, there you go. Awesome. So you got a lot coming up. The annual meeting up. golf, a lot on your plate right now. Yes. If people want to find out again more information, how can they best do that? Yep, they can call our office at 563-242-5702. Um, our newly launched website, growclinton.com. Uh, make sure you check that out. And our Facebook's a good page, a good place to go to. All so right. Great to see you. Thanks yep. so much. Thanks, Gary.